Hello, this is Nindy Kerr of Nindy's Creative Corner. Today we will be making a Father's Day card. My guys don't like it too. They call it floofy. So I made it relatively simple. Just used an embossing folder in the background. And I did two because I couldn't decide. And then I'm also, for this one, we'll be using the chevron background. So this is the hound's tooth. I can't remember if it's retired or not. The arrows, I think that's the name of it, and the chevron. We'll also be using the on film framelits. This is the second largest. And for the stamp set, we will be using the Happy Father's Day from the May 2014 Paper Pumpkin Kit. You can use whichever stamp set you'd like. Um, anyway, so let's get started. Okay, for this we will use our normal sandwich, a platform, either the magnetic platform or your multi-purpose platform with all of your tabs closed, cutting plate, some cardstock, in this case we're using Hello Honey, and then a new discovery parchment paper. I looked all over and could not find my parchment paper last night and so I mean I couldn't find my wax paper so I I used parchment paper which so far I think I like better than wax paper. Sticker still has the wax and it seems to come out a lot easier where before I tried it with the with just the cardstock and I had to use my piercing tool to pry it out which of course ruined the corner. Need our top cutting plate. Looks like I need to clean these off again. That's what happens when I share with my grandchildren. I don't know why we get marker on it, but we do. Okay, you'll notice it just comes right off. This punches right out. There's a little scrap here you can use for something else. And then there's this. I will go ahead and poke the little holes out with my piercing tool and then be back. Okay, we're ready to assemble things now. When I attach embossed pieces to a card base, I like to use Tombow glue. It adheres better than everything else in my opinion. And you don't need a lot, just a thin little layer close to the edge. If you get a thick layer, I mean if little globs even, spread it out. And technically you really don't need it any place except for the edge, but I can't help myself. I have to have a little fun. As you notice the fold is against the paper, standing up doesn't matter which direction I have this folder. So I just make sure it's lined up along the edge and the bottom and then press down. Okay, step one is done. Now this piece, oh, this is our new Mossy Meadow in color. This is very vanilla and it is cut at one and a half by two and five eighths. So it will fit behind this, but not cover up all those little film strip holes or whatever they're called. I'm also using Mossy Meadow ink, and like I said, this Happy Father's Day is from the Paper Pumpkin Kit. So just kind of center it. I'll see if I how well I can do it without my hair getting in the way. Probably down lower than I want, but it should be okay. Oops, looks like I missed one of those. Okay, let's just put, a, now there is a right side and a wrong side to this. The front side will feel smooth, and the back side, well not really rough, but not as smooth either. So make sure and put it on the back side. 
and just put a little bit of glue. I just love Tombow glue. And I'm going to try to center this. Get it over the edge of that. And before you press down, make sure it's in the position you want. Check on the front too. Okay, now we'll smooth it down here in the back. <coughs> Just a little Tombow glue on the outside edges in the center part. And then put it on crooked for a, I don't know, different effect. Looked better than when it was on straight. So there's a Father's Day card, quick and easy. And your guys should love it. Happy Father's Day. Bye.